Hi, Kelvin here. In this video, I will show you how to draw a line with distance and angle in AutoCAD. To actually start this drawing, I can start from any point, but let me start from this point. I will click the line command and pick any point on the screen and that becomes this point. I will press F8 on the keyboard to make the auto on so that I can have a straight line here. Next, I will type 80 and press enter or spacebar. When I get to this point, I want this line to be inclined at an angle of 58 degrees and a distance of 42 millimeters. To get this inclined line, I will type at the distance is 42, I will press shift key and less than symbol. I will enter this angle of 58. With the distance entered and the angle, I will press enter or spacebar. AutoCAD will give me this line. Now I'm done with this. Next, at this point, I will press F8 if my line is not straight because this line is not bent. This is a horizontal line. Next, at this point, I want AutoCAD to come down this way and draw this line. In mathematics, if I extend this line, this line is parallel to this line. And this line is cutting between the two parallel lines. If here is 52 degrees, here is also 52 degrees. Another way to look at this is 180 minus 1 to 8. The remaining angle here is 52. How will AutoCAD draw this line for me? To get this line, I will type at the distance is 45.15 less than the angle will be minus 52. Why minus? In AutoCAD, AutoCAD conventionally moves in the anticlockwise direction. But from this point, we want to move clockwise direction to draw this line. Hence, I'm going to put a minus. And AutoCAD will draw this line for me and I will press enter. It will snap at this point. I will press enter again to terminate the line and we are going to have this drawing. With this, let's get to AutoCAD environment and let's see how we are going to apply all this. Let's now draw this using AutoCAD. The first step is to load AutoCAD. Now in AutoCAD window, we are going to click the line command. Next, pick a point. This point becomes the first point where we are going to start our drawing. Next, press F8 on the keyboard to draw a straight line. Next, we we'll press, we we'll type 80. Press enter or tap the space bar. Next, at this point, I want an inclined angle of a distance of 42 millimeters at an angle of 58 degrees. Whether F8 is on or off, we are still going to get the specification as long as we type the correct command. Start with at a distance of 42 less than the angle is 58 press enter. Next, 
we are at this point. I need a horizontal line, not inclined. Next, I need a line distance of 30. Press enter. Next, at this point, I will have at the distance is 45.15 less than the angle is minus 52 minus because I want it to move in the clockwise direction. I will press enter. AutoCAD has given me the line distance and the angle. I'm done. Hence, I will press enter again or spacebar to terminate the line. And this is our drawing. Next, I can highlight this and change the color. Also, I can change the line weight. If the line weight is not visible, you can type line weight, enter, and make sure that display line weight is checked. Then you click OK. Next, let's check for the dimension. I will click dimension, click this end and the other end. Next, I will click this end, the other end. To get an aligned inclined dimension, I will go to aligned. Click this end, click the other end and that is 42. Next, I will click this end. Next, for the angle, I will click angular. Click here and here. And that is 122 degrees. I will click this line and this line. And that is 58 degrees. I will click this line and this line. That is 128 degrees. And I will click this line and click this line. And I got... 52 degrees.